So, welcome back again. Uh, seems like I've sorted out the problem with the internet. And we are back fighting the Ottomans. Winning, of course. They cannot have much of an army left now. Let's see what the ledger said. They have 49,460 manpower. It's like... It's what we see, and oh, <laughs> it just entered another war against Sicily, Spain, his well, this could be really interesting. So the question is, should we uh, Let's leave this one here and try to wipe out um, some more of his armies, which um, it seems like uh, Bohemia is already doing. One step ahead of us. I would so much like to wipe out that stack of 38. Should we have the honor to wipe them out? Yeah, we actually did. So, Ottomans. You now have an army of 4,000 men. That's not much. I think we could manage to take care of that. Hopefully... Uh, Naples will uh, take a few provinces from you and uh, making you weaker. But we don't want you to get too weak because then um, you will no longer be a val valid uh, enemy. A valid rival. Great, taking back some provinces. Uh, you can go down there. We could get prestige from land battle, 100%. That's good. We're actually having not so only 42, though we have won a lot of battles. Took two more provinces. Let's. Um, do you have some siege value? Yes, you have. Could you take Constantinople for us? Hmm. Seems like it is a large siege. How much more men do you need? You're actually attacking? Well, you're welcome. Um, no. Why can't you just walk right over there? Huh. <laughs> Well, if there's anything to learn from... <laughs> oh, because of the fort, of course. Uh, if there's anything to learn from these episodes, fighting as the Russian, is that 
as long as you have a lot of manpower, you can win any battle. It all depends on the manpower. Uh, so which fort should we take next? Um, actually, let's see if he's up for peace. Ottomans will cede that province. They will give us war reparations. They will be humiliated. I like that. Could we take another province? We could. Could we force them to release some nations? I do like that. Georgia. Okay. <laughs> no, we don't want them to. Bulgaria. Uh, Crimea. No, but we actually... Would, ni would be nice to... Have those provinces. Okay, so we... If we could, like, siege that down... Um, why are you? You don't need to attach to that unit. Um, let's siege that down and see if we could get that too. Do we have... See if we can occupy some more provinces. Yeah, you need to move. Go down and <coughs> take care of that fort. You have a huge fleet. How, I wonder how, how big fleet could I have? Um, <laughs> 55, well, the Russian fleet is not much to be, be scared of. Um, I want to see the siege. Well, 50 ducats, it's not much. Come on, come on, come on. Bohemia, are you still in the fight? Yeah, we have not peaced out yet. Would be really wonderful for to get rid of the Ottomans' fleet, but, well, I don't think that will happen in a while. Well, let's... Buckle up. Absolute rulership. Republican dictator. An absolute monarch. Okay. So, Ottomans, you want peace? Well, I don't think I could give you peace, I. Give some to the Mamluks. Ah. We won the siege of Wilno. That's good. Okay, so the Ottomans now. Oh! Huh! So where did that came from? Okay, so you have built up your army really quick. Um, we need to see if we could take care of that. 
I would like to well actually we have 50 percent um, demanding cafe is that okay That's quite good. We had three provinces. We get humiliated and we get war reparations. Well, that would be enough. Great. Um, why have I lost so much admin power? Oh, because we oh, went for the technology, damn. Uh, a base in India, Bengal. Bengal data owned by Russia. Russian get growing East Indian trade, trade efficiency, global trade power. Hmm. Or colonize Korontalo. Let's see what that where that is. Korontalo. Hmm, that's quite good will give us settler chance and global settler increase <laughs> but where is this Bengal Delta okay so we actually get a claim on that it's really far away We would need boats to get there. Do we... Huh. No, <laughs> that's crazy because it will take forever to get down there, so... No, uh, I think we should just stick around, try to colonize some more, and uh, just wait for our uh, provinces to hopefully give us some gold, because that's what we want, gold, and wait for the last... Uh, achievement to kick in we will need uh, just one more percent of patriarch authority to get that last achievement well we need a gold achievement also if I would like to stick around to get it it is 1678 71 I mean of course uh, it's so far away. To attack Japan, 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 I would need to have boats, and I don't like that. Because it isn't possible to get now. I can get to here, but how are we doing in the States? California. Whoa. Pacific Notre. It must be Spanish. French Canada, British Mexico, New Spain is growing, New Granada, 
We have the 13 colonies. Cherokee. New Norway. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, Vinland. Cool. So, and how are we doing in Africa? We have Great Britain, of course, getting strong. We have a new colony, that's good. But we have no gold colony yet. Let's speed things up. Well, so the big question is what to do next. Um, it would be a really big thing to trying to get down to India to get the gold provinces down there. To get the provinces down here in Samarkand, where were they? They were somewhere over here, weren't they? Let's have a look. I think that will be a little too big step. Yeah, over there. Well, let's lose some Diplo power. That's very far down. Hmm. I wonder if we should... Yeah, I think we should use some... Um, uh, Diplo power to boost our... Because as soon as we go to war, we will have problem with economy. So we need to boost our gold. In Irkutsk. Irkutsk is over here. So, we need to boost these two first. Then we can boost the gold. Could we... That's actually 10 already. Then why aren't you giving... Hmm, why aren't we getting more gold when this is 10? That's weird. Culture? Let's boost this too. That will give us some more gold. That's great. A lot more. <laughs> we actually almost get as much gold, money from gold, as we get from trade. That's nice. So. Yeah, maybe this is the way to go. Colonize this one. Attacking Yarkand. Or is it possible? Even now. <coughs> Let's see. Could declare war. Bohemia will not join in. Hungary will not join in because it's a distance war. Sindh. Bengal, that's very far down. Balush. Down. Oh, so you will join in. Huh. Well, yeah, we could actually see if there is any possibility at all to... We could actually annex some of our vassals. Do we want to? We have Kazan. 
Alkiva and Corson. Yeah, so they would actually. Hmm. There's no gold down here. I have to go all the way to Africa to get some gold. I don't like that. I want gold, more gold. Well, we have to attack. So, uh, let's first... Um, yeah, let's wait. Azov. Where is Azov? It's over there. Quite a bit of unrest here. Let's do like that. Boom. We will have no rebel fraction. Um, so now we can move our s soldiers. I wonder if it won. Two. Yeah, and we can actually mothball all forts. We have 19 forts. That's 19 ducats. Boom. And you can move down there. We have, if we have three, three troops who will take care of that, it should be enough. And the rest of you could march up here to Yarkand. Supply limit 36, that's quite enough. Okay, so I died. Ooh, we got a wonderful heir to the throne. A four four six. A four four six, that's wonderful. How old are you? Eight. Well, as soon as you are only sixteen. As soon as you are like 15 or 16, we will make Boris general, and hopefully you will die so we can get you for a very long time. Bohemia, yes, we will marry you. Hungary, are we married? No. Royal marriage, bam. Still have that mission. Next one is 63, 69. We actually get plus 13 every month. Month. That's good. Maybe we could actually core this one. So we have one, two, three. Could actually get another one up because right after we have won this war, we want to attack Oriat so we can take at least one province to get down to these provinces. Or could we actually? Ah, that's wasteland, and that's wasteland. So, our troops will be moving, getting in position for our next war. Um, we are still growing. I think that if we, with a little luck, we will get uh, the achievement in the name of the father in like I don't know next episode next two or three episodes at least 
Uh, Russia is quite big. Uh, we have the rank of number six. We are first in admin, first in military. We are very bad in diplomatic rank. I think it's mostly because of our ships or lack of ships. It's great. Have another call. Yeah, it's going quite well. Uh, our manpower took a little hit earlier when at a war against the Ottomans. We lost like, I don't know, 150,000 men or something like that. Are you still in a war? Yeah. That's great. Hopefully you will lose. But not too many provinces. Is it winter? No. Then why are you? Hmm. Well, that's too... Mercenaries, that's quite good. Um, why are you getting attraction? Oh, you're not in a Oh, maybe there were two or three armies on the same. So uh no 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 not missions we need to call i want to call yes great so should we attack why not do we have Let's attack so we could uh, easily um, colonize these two. Let's get a war. Oh, we have no causes belly. So we. Uh, but we could actually attack Oriat, which are your allies. Idiot. Or we could just wait until this colony is done and we're not in a hurry. That's quite good because we could take care of some overextension. And hopefully get that last point of patriarch authority. Power projection is quite good. Giving us plus 5.1% plus in moral armies is good. Um, permanent natives. Uh, okay. Construction upkeep of the ships. Price of nav naval supplies changed by plus 15. Yeah, so we got that. Uh, let's lose 50 diplo power. And let's colonize this. We want gold. We want gold. Come on, give me gold. Would be nice to attack you, China. 
No, I don't want grain. Ah, oh, boring. Oh. These provinces are like... <laughs> really far away. It doesn't give us much at all. 0 0.01 tax, 0 0.06 production. Well, eventually they will grow. I... Oh! Yes, I will protect their independence. In the name of the Father. So we got it. Eventually, we got. Uh, the achievement in the name of the Father. So, should we uh, continue uh, trying to get that achievement of having 10 gold provinces? I don't know. Maybe. But right now, I um, think I will at least take a big break from this episode. Maybe trying to play something else but we got it we got the achievement in the name of the father and that's what we came for so thank you for watching and uh, well i see you next time bye bye